Hello and welcome to another Let's Play mission of Knights of Mosin the Felon Rebellion the Remake. This time I'm going to do mission 9. Uh, well, without further ado, let's start. Speed up. Alright, first, uh, of course, I'm going to scout. Again, I only played this mission twice now. This was the second time. So I'm not doing it completely correctly. Uh, you have two enemies. One is uh, this peasant uh, thingy. They uh, begin with, uh, well, obviously too much. No weapons though. That's good. Then you got this one. The purple one who, have, who has conquered your... Uh, your f the first mission you do, you start in this in this land as, as well. You have this uh, fortress. Now it is his. He starts with no weapons here. And uh, no weapons in here. And well, a lot of forces. But also no weapons, so you have to do it all. You have to build everything. So that's good. Uh, I'm sorry uh, it took so long before I uh, re upload again. I uh, uploaded again, but that's because uh, I was lying in the hospital, so. Yeah, that makes it a little bit difficult to uh, upload and to record, so that's why the delay. Uh, okay, so I'm going for uh, four stone masons right away, then for my uh, wood I will cut this down, I believe, so I can build there, same over here. Uh, we just, uh, you start with a little bit of food and some, some, some gold and of course some stone and wood, but that's it. I find this mission, it, it took me quite a long time, almost six hours, but that's because I fucked it up over here. Because basically you have to attack him from over here, it's easier. But I, I, I was just playing around a little bit and didn't do it all that well. I didn't plan anything, I just attacked and it cost me a lot of troops. But it doesn't matter. As you can see, you don't have any iron here, so that's good. I like it. No iron is good. This one, of course, you're going to kill first. He's basically, uh, he's very easy. He's not really that difficult. He isn't either. Uh, I believe he attacked me once or something. As you can see, he has a lot of, lot of shit. Once I've killed the when once I killed this, I thought like yes I'm done and then I oh crap even more. But it doesn't matter. Alright, so uh, three uh sawmills. Uh this woodcutter is only cutting wood. Sorry that I put it on uh, Dutch again, but it's because I'm playing a multiplayer. And then people know I'm Dutch. So uh it built some more woodcutters down here for I also got a lot more builders as you can see. I already have 15 now. I'm not sure how far I get in this one. I go for my gold production right away after I build the uh, woodcutters. This one's cutting only as well. I also already have only, only 22 cents, so it's not that big of a deal yet. So we'll see. And meanwhile, he's still not doing anything. He's still uh, making weapons and stuff like that. So, uh, got more, more than enough time. Even more woodcutters. Uh, and I want to welcome the new people on my uh, ser on my server. It's on the server, man. On my uh, it's called anyway. Hmm. I don't know. Page, YouTube page, and uh, uh, welcome. Thank you for subscri subscribing. It means a lot. 
As you can see, I built six wine uh, vineyards and three gold melters. I also run out of wood, I believe, somewhere around here. There was uh, actually a mistake. I, I should have built it up where, a little bit over here, over here because I, was, I'm, I will be running out of uh, place, uh, building spot, uh, place. So just blah, blah, blah. Building. How do you say that? I don't know. Building space, not place. Space. So uh, I, you should build it over here a little bit, uh, not too close because of the attacks, of course. But uh, around the the, the the road thingy. So you can use this as well for something else, because now, because now I'm basically locked it up a little bit. Of course I can go over here, but then you get a lot of traffic over this one road, is that good? Mm. Here I built some uh, weapon makers already, with a uh, barracks. See the wood is uh, they are planting their lives. A lot of trees, so that's good. Almost run out of food. That's why I uh, built so many uh, vineyards because I wanted to do this first. I have uh, still 15 workers. You can also do with 20. If you want, it goes a little bit faster still. And if you really want to, you can even go to 30. And then when you're done building, just select something over here, you know, just place a, uh, I don't know, field over there, and then they will go there and they will die. It's also a trick I've learned in uh, multiplayer. As a multiplayer, you only have one hour to build up the base and build up an army. And, well, the way I did build my uh, base, it was, well, multiplayer, was not multiplayer. The way you must do it on multiplayer, let's say it like that. As you can see now, I built uh, quite a lot of farms. A mill over here. I, I played this game a long time ago, so I'm not really sure what I did and when I did what, so it's kind of a surprise for me too. In the meanwhile, he's still not doing anything. I believe he's going to uh, build up his army soon. I still don't know when the, when the enemy does it, and what time, because they start at the same time, but do they start when you start producing weapons, do they start at a particular time? For example, in one hour or something, I don't know. Let's see. Two, be uh, two males, three uh, pig. pig farms. As you can see, I'm building uh, X's already. He's still not doing anything. I'm gonna see what time he's going to do it. I'm really interested in that. I'm still a little bit tired from the operation, so if I'm sound a little bit like, uh, that's why. I just got back like two days ago, I think, or yesterday. Oh, it was yesterday. No, yesterday was Sunday, so oh, I came back Saturday. I uh, put this on uh, chop only because I needed a, lot, a little bit more space, a little bit more farms. This one also chop only, so that I will delete these two eventually. Even put this on chop only. And I will build some more over here eventually. As you can see, my uh, wood is not going up that good, but it doesn't matter. Also, have a stable. Of course, 
Alright, he started, so basically at one hour, I think. I think he starts at one hour. Alright, so, uh, leather armor makers. This are that three, uh, nothing here, I believe. Oh. Still only got 14 serves. 14, not 14. So not that much yet. I will go up eventually. I even believe I built some more schools. Where I do not know. Another magazine. This guy is uh, hungry. <laughs> I also believe now I still don't have a uh, salt bakery. I'll build that now, I believe. Somewhere. No, it's still not. It's just some good colors. There's my second school. Mm. There's the bakery. And there's the bakery. I completely forgot to build them, so that's why I uh, yeah, it, it, it wasn't on purpose or anything, I just forgot. Well, it happens. Apparently. So, woodcutters are done again. Got six now. Already got uh, almost a group of uh, X Men. I don't know what I was trying to build here. Oh, it was a woodcutter. Still not building any recruits because you just wait with that until you have quite a lot of. Uh, stuff in your uh, barracks because otherwise you have to feed them and then want that at least I don't want that Let's see what else do I build I don't build anything at the moment I'm building uh, serves. I'm not. What I'm doing? I'm not doing anything. Oh, here I go. Mines. I'm building a lot of mines. We're not, con we're not connecting them yet. Stone's almost empty. He's not building up very fast, but at least he has something now. He's uh, going a little bit faster. He's not doing anything yet. I believe uh, this is also from, from this guy. He's got two bases, of course, this one and, and this one. I'm not sure what is with who. I believe this entire thing is, is from this base and these groups are from this base. I'm not sure. Alright, so now I'm... What am doing now? Nothing. Waiting. Making uh, serves, I guess. Yes. Oh, there I go. Why did it? Why did it then? I don't know. So 
it was kind of a mistake because he won't reach that, but it doesn't matter. Alright, so now I'm connecting to uh, the coal mines. As you can see, my weapons are going up quite nicely. I'm making a lot of... Uh, what's it called? Lancers and, and, and uh, Bowman in this mission. Because he has a lot of horses. I didn't know that yet, but... I thought I remembered that he had a lot of horses, so that's why. <clears throat> Alright, still no... F no, still no uh, butcher. So now they're done. It's a little bit overkill, a little bit too much, but oh well. Doesn't matter, in my opinion. Why the hell do I, I still don't have a picture? Oh, I got my first. Uh, First group of un uh, unit group of units. That's my second. I also believe I'm going to build some towers over here. And then I'm going to destroy him. There are my arches. Second group. There go the towers. This is going to destroy out. There are my first lancers. First going to put them down here because they are building over here, so. As you can see, my, my micro is not that good yet, because I'm, I'm not making any more weapons. And once I've destroyed him, I will attack from this side, but then I retreat, because I'm almost dead. And for some reason, I pull in this entire group, so everything dies. But it doesn't really matter. Those mistakes are, you can expect those mistakes when you just do it for the first or second time. Because you're not completely sure what uh, the aggro range and stuff like that. There goes my, uh, I built my butcher. Finally. Got that 36 and 22, so 58 already. There goes the towers. And uh, maybe the back entrance is the way to attack him. He tells you about this part. Of course, I didn't know where it was. Well, I'd like. I do know where it is, but... So now I put everything the way I want it. And I basically did this to get uh, all those uh, pillars away from here. I could have w waited and uh, just let them go when they were hungry, but oh, I like I, I like this way. I mean, I didn't wasn't going to use this anyway. So As you can see a lot of farms. I've got uh, ten farms. There's quite a lot. 
Well, then again, I also got... Uh, I only got a second stable, so... But, I believe this is the best way. Well, how's my food going? Not that good. Not really bad, actually. Well, my first group of horses. I have actually no food at all. Oh. Only furs. Only got 70 furs. Right now, I go attack him. I do it in two times because everything here is getting killed. Let's put it on F3, F6, three times. Alright, later until they attack. But I can take it on one. So, three groups of uh, archers, one group of X Men, and one group of horsemen. Spies. Oh, come on, go, 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 go. Good all time. Got my puller. Always use one. There we go. As you can see, he's getting uh, destroyed. He pulled everything. And put your, uh, your puller all the way back because I found out that if you attack him, everything will attack that puller. And if you pull the back all the way here, the, the archers won't attack you. As you can see, I, I didn't pull anything of this, but I got almost everything. So that's good. And then I storm in because I thought he doesn't didn't have anything anymore, but he has quite a lot. So this will die eventually, because I didn't do it the correct way. I just put them down here, why do I put them down here? Well, just do this. Because as you can see, I, I pulled back my two other groups of ex uh, bowmen, and I shouldn't have done that, because now I... Uh, my group, my, my, my troops will die. I don't hear him. I just realized. Huh. I don't know why that is. Doesn't matter. Swim around a little bit. Alright, my food is going up now, I believe. Yes, it is. Slowly but surely. As you can see, I don't really have a big base. It's really compact. But everything you need is in here. Nice a lot of uh, woodcutters. You need a lot of wood. And I don't want to wait too long. So now I uh, basically make another group. I'm going to attack them again. This time I won't fail, I believe like a noob. Build another group of horses? No, that's fine. Okay. Alright, we'll also build this group of archers. I'm gonna take them from this side, okay. This time I don't use a puller, because I knew he doesn't have, he didn't have that much archers anymore. It's basically you use a puller because of the arches. Because if you don't use a puller and just attack with your full group, that group will die. And if one arch dies, it doesn't really matter, does it? There they go. As you can see, Normally that doesn't happen. Oh, 
out, so now uh, he basically died. I believe I even pull a group in uh, another group of horses in. Somewhere. Just uh, let your uh, archer skill discuss. Don't bother with this end yet. Oh, I made another group of something. Oh, excellent. Oh, let's see, I made uh, 13 inch men. Some, they're dying, I don't know why. As you can see, no more serves, so now I basically just attack these towers. Uh, just watch yourself so that when he pulls something out, you know, a unit, you, you just press uh, Halt. Then they will attack that unit, destroy it, and then attack this uh, tower again. As you can see here, I didn't do that. <laughs> so, yeah, you have to do that. One last one of these. And meanwhile, still making weapons, I believe. Yes. Just making uh, axes and uh, long longbows. Eventually I'll go over to Lancers, I believe. My, uh, a lot of, uh, all my mines are tried out, so I will eventually will be you doing something about that, I believe, but I still have four on the goal almost, so no problem with that. Slowly, uh, destroying him now. Now I'm going to take his uh, barracks, pulling back my archers. Alright, so now, uh, now I'm going to just going to destroy him. And again, don't destroy everything. Why? Why should you just waste the time? You can do it if you want to, if you like it. I uh, basically uh, just destroy his main body. Then he starts. If you fight against me, you will die. If you die, fight against me, you will die in a horrible way. That's obvious. If you're not a uh, warrior, at least. I also believe I'm going to build some more over here, but I don't know when I'm going to do that. My food is going up very nice. Well, my bread isn't, but my meat and my uh, wine is. You can see it's quite a lot, so this will take another, well, three hours. Because, as I said in the remake, the difference between iron units and leather units is a lot, it's a bit bigger. So it will take more units to destroy everything. Alright, so here I go and build some more uh, wood posts. I don't know why, I get a lot of wood. But I believe I'm going to destroy these two. Put these on the cutting only. Not sure what I'm going to do. Maybe some more arms or something. Oh no, I thought. Oh, I don't know why. Oh, let's see. I believe I'm going to buy 30 ores soon. Still making weapons, armors. Let's continue making them. Let's 
See here, I'm going to scout now. So I wanted to know what he has there. I'm going to attack the Q unit one of the destroy unit there, of course. Because, but I just wanted to know what he has. That's why I'm doing this, and I still want to do. I want to know what he has. So, if you just pull one unit over here, he will die. You know, see this, you know, not really help. So basically, you have to sacrifice some units to see what he has. Because I didn't know. I'm my first one of the well, that's not Puller. I just made a Puller of this. I believe he dies. Yes. As you can see, he has a lot. Basically, if you take him, you will pull this. So then you have this group still, and you have this group, and you have to have this group. So, he's a lot. But this is a nice um, uh, bottleneck, so if you pull and then you get your puller out, just pull them all the way over here. Why? So the crossbowmen of this don't attack you, because you don't want them. And basically what I'm going to do soon is both fully pack this and uh, slowly kill him. They will die, of course. Speed it up. But I knew what he had now. A lot. That was not everything, of course. And now I'm making lots, as you can see. I just put everything on. A little more that it's going to look faster. I didn't do anything to him. I think I killed two or three of them. Uh, three, four. Well, not a lot at least. But it wasn't the purpose of those two groups. The purpose was to find out what he had. Yes, you can also scout with one unit. And I'm going to deal with the horses. That wasn't the best option. Oh, I'm not even doing it. Because it isn't a good option to do with the horses. In the beginning it is, but eventually he has a lot of uh, pikes. So the pikes will destroy the units and your uh, horses, please. Alright, so there goes my. Oh no, I used it to measure how many <laughs> uh, units can stand together next to each other. Oh, I use the forces. And it were uh, eight, as you can see here. Four wise. And I'm going to make uh, 20, 32 lances. So it will take a while. Or I will use my horses on that. Let's see. I know eventually I will do it with lances. And maybe I could have. Build another. You can do that with no problem. I mean, you got a lot of wood. Got a 70 serves. So maybe I could use some more. I can see now that I got my first attack again. It, it was my first attack. See what I can do with that. I can do quite a lot. Surprised how much I killed with it. You know, let's see what he has. So, a lot of horses, crossbowmen, some swordsmen, a lot of horses again. Yeah, the horses are not that good against monsters, of course. So, let's see what left on the one. Let's speed it up again. I believe I fail and then he dies. There he goes. Do, do, do. Yeah, that's the sun in. Let's watch. As you see, you can pull a lot. You pull in this entire thing. It's quite a lot. But since this is a nice bottleneck, you will kill a lot of them. 
but it's too sad, sad you don't have any cross bow meat because then uh, you kill a lot more. I also believe now I retreat these groups, yes, you see here, and that's why I pull again. So, everything's going wrong. So, this will all die soon. See here. Use those horses to uh, defend your archers. Basically, what you do is defend your archers with other units and let your archers kill everything. Now, it's now got 32. I lost 32 lances and a group of 15 horsemen, spies. Now, some other horsemen are here now. Um, and some other things. All those are going to die, because they have bloody pikes. And I believe these will still retreat. When? I don't know. Now? Yes, now. And because I retreat, for some reason I pulled this. Let's see. There we go. And I do not know why this is this is, but um, was of course too late uh, to react because I didn't know they was attacking. But uh, they will be attacked from both sides. We'll pull this back in eventually, but because I didn't do it correctly, everything dies quite fast. Also, a lot of uh, serfs will die, as you can see here. But he will retreat again when your units are dead, so that's good. We want to attack you further. And basically, I believe that the, the, the enemy is a fencing, a defensing position in this mission. So he won't attack you that often. But as you can see, it's quite, it destroyed quite a lot. But well, I lost quite a lot here, but that was because wasn't uh, prepared for it, but only with these three groups over here, yeah, I killed the entire group, so that's good, and some, I killed the other this entire group, especially in this, half, 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 so it's quite a nice, it's quite a nice uh, mistake, okay, it should take a while to rebuild everything, but, Well, but as you can see, it's quite a lot more. But there's a trick to destroy this actually, it's quite easy. A lot of bowmen over here. Pull it, we'll walk all the way down, lock this up with units, bowmen, bowmen. He will be in the middle and in the back. That's basically how I do this, uh, that group at least. Okay, I built a lot of uh, <laughs> turfs all of a sudden. They too now. I still didn't get another button. I don't know why. This tree is much better, I believe. We just built uh, serves until they don't do anything like this. Then you know you're okay. Don't get crazy, just build a couple and then see what happens. And build a couple again. Because you keep building them, building them, building them, then you have so many serves you don't want them. Another group of archers is to see. Ah, there we go. I thought already. I built another uh, two uh, weapon makers and another armor maker. Because it was going too slowly, in my opinion. We need to drink. And I got a 
enough uh, wood. That's a great that I don't have enough uh, skins, but. So this one makes a lot of uh, same. Eventually, I will run out of wood and put those to hold, but not yet. So let's see, just rebuilding my army again. Then I attack him again, of course. As you can see, I'm building a lot faster than he is, luckily. Because basically, he's run out of uh, armor. Hmm. Didn't know that. Nice to see. And a lot of uh, iron, though. He's almost out. Basically, what you can do, of course, is just attack him, attack him, attack him, attack him until he runs out of material. <laughs> then you will destroy him easily. But I think eventually he will attack. He will attack. I don't know. That's the beauty of uh, single play. You can take all day, and nobody's going to be mad. Cigarettes. I know it's bad for your health, but okay. So, I don't know what I'm waiting for. We'll see what I'm going to do now. A 32 spike. See that sooner? So even more farms. Could I build horses? Arches. Do another good rush down here. Cats running all the way, all the way around my living room, destroying everything. You can't get mad at them, do you? He's too sweet. Climbing in my tree, my living room. Plant, a big, big ass plant. Like five minutes. Um, basically preparing to attack again. He's going to be down. Still doesn't have that much. That's good. There we go again. They're chasing each other. Kind of funny. So now I still have 32. I don't know why I don't destroy them yet. Don't matter. As you can see here, now I changed to a uh, pikeman. Still got a lot of uh, X, but that's for my horses. Because he has a lot of horses, and well, pikemen are good, like, just like. Oh, they, these are black. 
nonsense out that you can see. Never I am seen. Horses. So, I don't know, I just like them the way they look. They're cool. Still a many more units. I don't know what I'm waiting for to come out. See the big picture. This is my base. As everybody knows by now. Not that big. Well, not that big. Quarter of the map. This is the enemy. What a nice. I don't know why I even tell you. Uh, build another group of archers. Only one hour to go. <laughs> Who's going down again? That's what I said. I've got a lot of wine, so I've got some back up. We'll see how it goes. I go my lances, 32 of them, I believe. And that's 8 times 3, no, oh, 1 times 3 is so. more. These are 32. It's 24. Now I'm going to attack him again. He doesn't have that much. Also, now I'm bring back, bring down a group of horses and a group of axemen. To back up. Of course, my puller. Over there. They like dancing. Run for a run! And he survives, that's cool. Oh, that's cool. I do you believe I destroyed this group now? We'll see. Yeah, I am easily. A lot easily. Lost uh, 10 at the moment. Oh, yeah, easily. Basically, he doesn't have the time to kill me, so that's good. Room, that, room, that, room, that. Alright, so this group uh, is completely down now. I attack him, but I thought, well, I'm going to destroy this, and then I pull this. <laughs> that's kind of funny. Speed it up a little bit. See what I'm going to do now. As you can see now, I pull this. I wasn't expecting that. I pulled them back. But not enough. As you can see here, and I put these guys in front of this to defend them, of course. And I believe I fuck, really fucked this up again. Yes, I have fucked this up. But again, I uh, just slowly kill him. At least you can do it in one t in one turn. It's okay. Of course. Mm, do it. You can see now I pull everything again by attacking this one. But I forgot to pull it back, and that's why the crossbowmen now attack. That was kind of a mistake. That again, but I got more years coming. So, as you see, there's a lot more, so this is going to take another well, another hour before I finally defeat him. Oh, 
There's a lot of uh, weapons. That's good. And we need uh, some for goods now. And so a lot more uh, leather armor. A lot of wood. I believe these guys are down. Yes, I put them in. Not letting him do anything because I got enough weapons. And I got my recruits. Two at a time. If you get a third, it's also good. Then, I mean, preschool is a good uh, strategy. And another group of archers. Again, 32. I just let's keep them uh, down here. Eventually, they will attack for them. Nothing here anymore. But, uh. First, we're going to destroy this, I believe, and then this. We'll take another two waves of three. From my part. There we go again, 24. What else I'm going to change to 24 horses. What else? Maybe some more arches? Got another uh, leather maker too. Yes, as you can see, my skins are going up. Quite a lot. Can you see that? Quite a lot. I don't know how to really say it, but you know what I mean. So I'll build another one with a third leather cluster as well. There's my puller. So, I think we need to do with this one. Uh -huh. We're well, going to feed them all, I guess. I could have used another group of archers, but basically one group of archers is enough if you can keep them alive. I guess they will do damage. Still, I guess, still nothing. We made some uh, pike. That's it. Basically, what I'm going to do now is uh, attack the stable, so I will pull everything he has here. Run back. As you can see now. No, second. Oh, sorry. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. So now I'm going to uh, check him again. But then I found out that not really anything is happening because he doesn't have anything anymore. I'll pull that back. That. So I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do now, to be honest. Let's do it on speed times 10. Ready to do that.
I've um, got five, and so I've got five pullers. Then I found out what is not going to work, takes too long. So I put it's like this one, so I put everything. I hope I don't die. I was lucky there. Not to believe, no, not yet. As you can see, I basically put everything up here. So I'm gonna kill that, he only has this left. Got my horses ready to move into the place of the pikemen. But then I thought, well, you've got a lot of, got a lot of pikemen as himself, so I swapped them with my axemen. So now that I'm going, I'm also coming down from up there to destroy this. See, now I'm going to bottleneck him, at least uh, I'm going to uh, start preparing for it. Send these back to food to eat, because hey, they're hungry. No, oh, they're not a total asshole. Now a little bit so you can see, you can see more. Put these down here, up, up here, so I can flank them. Those can destroy this one. Those will be in the way. Now we're going to pull him with these. Let's put it down again. As you can see here, he's not going to survive this. Still not pulling that, pulling everything. Still got some X Men over here, so that's good. Speed it up again. Basically, I put everything together and uh, we'll pull the rest.
And I know there's only uh, crossbow men after I destroyed this one, so then I swarm them in. Just pull them in and destroy them. I lose a couple, but at this point it doesn't really matter. So now I pull back, uh, pull down these uh, X-Men and uh, another group of horses. Just uh, what I have left, what I had left, and to destroy his base. But this is basically how you do it. Obviously not the mistakes I did, but Zanger from here, bottleneck him, so um, pull him into this narrow stuff so you can feed him easily. He won't attack you, at least he didn't attack me. And uh, basically that's it. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. See you at the uh, other thing where uh, I'm going to show how much I lost and stuff. So, yeah, see you guys then. See ya. Alright, so uh, as you can see, lost units, uh, 600, destroyed 900, destroyed 20 buildings, constructed 91, took me 5 hours, almost 6, well, that's kind of good. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed it, I hope you guys learned something from it, and I'll see you guys in the 10. Alright, thank you for watching, see ya.